First at six, did a program run by a woman with closed ties to Mayor Mike Duggan get preferential treatment from the city? Tonight, the seven investigators are digging into a potential conflict of interest and just how a $50,000 donation made its way to a program linked to the mayor. Seven investigator Ross Jones is here now with new revelations and how the mayor is now responding to all of this. Ross? Carolyn, Dave, good evening. Since the Detroit Free Press first raised questions about the mayor and make your date, Mayor Duggan has insisted his office never use city resources to help fundraise for the program. But information we've obtained tonight shows that a city fundraiser was involved from the very beginning. It was a call from Mayor Mike Duggan's office that opened the door for a donation from this Bloomfield Hills nonprofit supporting Make Your Date. According to officials with the Carls Foundation, it was February of last year when Monique Phillips, a development officer from the Mayor's Office of Development and Grants, first called about Make Your Date. Somebody from the city called to ask about this particular, about the possibility of us providing funds for the management or the um, operations of this particular program. Elizabeth Stieg is the executive director of the Carls Foundation and said the work being done by Make Your Date to help bring down Detroit's infant mortality rates fit with their mission. The program is run by Dr. Sonia Hassan, whose home Mayor Duggan was seen visiting last summer in video shot by a private investigator. Since the story first broke, Duggan has insisted his office never fundraised for Dr. Hassan's program. We never in any way supported or directed a cent to the nonprofit. The partnership was with Wayne State University directly. But Wayne State didn't enter the fray until weeks or months later after the call from the mayor's office. It was last summer when a formal meeting was held discussing how the foundation could help make your date. The mayor's office stayed involved. You were there, Wayne State was there. Mm -hmm. Was anybody from the mayor's office there? Yes, a young woman, I don't recall her name. That woman was Monique Phillips from Duggan's Office of Development and Grants. Ultimately, the Carls Foundation made a donation of more than $50,000 that went to support Make Your Date. When I was elected mayor, the city of Detroit had the highest infant mortality rate in America. More babies dying before their first birthday. Whether Make Your Date is a program worthy of donations isn't up for debate. It is credited with helping bring down Detroit's infant mortality rate, and Dr. Hassan's work for the program is completely volunteer. She doesn't make a dime from it. But the question tonight, did Duggan's relationship with the doctor give her program a leg up others didn't receive? In a statement, Mayor Duggan's chief of staff, Alexis Wiley, says the city, quote, made an inquiry with the Carls Foundation early on, but it became very clear that their services weren't needed and that Wayne State University could help secure the funding from the Carls Foundation on its own. Still, the mayor's office was kept in the loop on fundraising for Make Your Date for months and attended at least one meeting about securing funds last summer. We should add, we did attempt to reach a spokesperson for Dr. Hassan, but so far, we've been unable to reach him. I'm Ross Jones, 7 Action News. Ross, thank you.